right, well, here's what's happening today. PPAC is full of magic this week as they welcome the hit Broadway musical, Aladdin. We got a chance to go backstage to chat with a stage manager and a wardrobe supervisor to see how they prep for one of the largest shows on the road. Check it out. We have a crew of 70 folks backstage that are helping us um, do the show every night. So they're doing props, costumes, scenery, lighting, sound, um, all kinds of things backstage. They're even firing pyro. And um, it is our job to make sure that the cues are happening as they should and that everything is safe and with the music. The creative team definitely thought about the level of detail and everything when they were putting the show together. They went to Marrakesh and they were inspired by the colors and the shapes that they saw there. And you can see that level of authenticity in everything backstage. The thing that I love about this show in particular is that it's taken all of those like iconic things, iconic looks that we're so used to, you know, seeing when we think of Aladdin, and they've just kind of heightened it. All of the costumes, especially Aladdin, you know, as soon as you see him, yeah. you're like, that's it. Yes. He has the vest, he yes. has the fez, you know, he has those big blousy pants. Uh, they've changed the colors a little bit. The genie, especially, too, there was such a conscious decision not to make him, you know, he's not painted blue. They kind of were able to genify him in different ways, so, he's, mm -hmm. so his costumes are very very vibrant. Yeah. This is the the teal and you know obviously in the film it's just solid teal but here you know we've decided to just Go put sequins it. all over it. Yeah. They're just so intricate and things that you don't see on stage are still there you know it's yes. not we're not trying to fake anything everything is real everything mm -hmm. is beaded everything is detail oriented. There's a lot of fun, there's adventure, there's sword fighting, and then there's also the romance between Aladdin and Jasmine. So I think there's something for everybody. Those swords were real, by the way. The costumes were so heavy because they are so intricately done and the fabrics are beautiful. Clearly the backstage choreography is just as important as what happens on stage. Now listen to this, the ensemble has the most extensive wardrobe. Mm -hmm. There are about 350 costumes, wow. 191 hats oh are God. worn during the production and the quickest costume change is 15 seconds. You could do that. Well, I have well, for a workout <laughs> segment. No, no, yeah, that's true. Workout segments. I'm like, what second she's in a workout gear? Next second, second she's not. I don't know if I could get it down to 15 seconds right. though. As you saw, some of the costumes, one of which was Jasmine, later on in the show, we're going to chat with Jasmine and a member of the ensemble as well. I know a bunch of people who went to see the show and said they absolutely loved the show. Thought it was great. great. Thought the music was up, upbeat mm -hmm. and really truly enjoyed it. Do you think they would let us ride on the, the magic carpet? That's what I wanted. Oh, to that do. would be Wouldn't awesome. That, be fun? Oh, <laughs> that would be fun. Oh, no. That would be fun. Yeah, I could see it now. That'd be it could fun. Be a lot. Wear a little fez. Sure, why not, right? All right.